Beaupre. Good hit applied by Cortico to the hammer Hostick, and he'll pay for it. And now in comes Partner, and Cortic is after him. Partner trying to turn away, now decides that he wants it. Initially, it was just going to be a Cortic penalty. By Terry. Oh, wow, what a left by Carter. What a left. And Cortic is a lefty. That's why Carter has to go with the left. Boy, look out. Same as the Berube May fight. They don't have quality grips on one another, so they're throwing roundhouses. That's how somebody gets knocked out. Terry Gardner is obviously wound up for this game. Doesn't happen often, but you can sense it very early. His demeanor on the ice is completely different than it is in, in other games. Man, it looked like Gardner landed a straight left that popped Cordick's helmet right back onto his head. Here's what started it. Kordick right there, ramming into Martin Hostick. Koharski was calling a charge, I think, on that one. And then Terry Kartner came in and said, all right, you want a piece of him? You got to try me first. And going backwards, Kartner slipped. Was lucky that Kordick didn't meet him with a big left when he spun around. Kind of funny, Terry Kartner looked like he, he was undecided as to what he wanted to do. Now, Kartner's helmet came off, too, so Kordick might have landed one while Kartner landed his own. Boy, oh boy. More to come. It's not over yet, folks.